There is only one learning objective for video TR-29. Be able to solve triangles using the law of cosines. Solve the triangles. You can pause and work them all out. I'll step through the leftmost and show its answers, then show the solutions for the last two after another pause. There's an important note about trick problems at the end. For the first triangle, we might need to do a little transcribing, but it turns out we're given two sides and the angle between them. Note that the angle is in radians. With no angle side opposite pair, we use the law of cosines using the given angle b and its opposite side, lowercase b. b squared equals a squared plus c squared minus 2ac cosine b. We solve this equation for lowercase b and then use the law of sines using the b's to find the other two angles. Pause if you like to figure out the answers before I display them all at once for the left triangle. Now can you solve the other two triangles on your own? Pause if you like and I'll show the answers for both. You should watch out for impossible triangles in the measurements you're given. The triangle on the left looks innocent enough, but the two sides of length 10 are too short to form a triangle with the third side of length 21. They can't meet in the middle. The sum of any two sides of a triangle must be longer than the third side. This is true for any pair of sides, but you really only have to check that the sum of the two shortest sides is longer than the longest side. Sometimes instructors like to throw in a problem like this. If you don't notice that the triangle is impossible, you'd start solving the problem with the law of cosines, and you'll end up having to take the arc cosine of a number greater than 1 or less than negative 1, which is undefined. This will be your clue to take a closer look. It's easy to make up your own triangles to solve. You can check your work with an online triangle solver like this one. Practice to build your confidence.